I'm here today with local entrepreneur Lori Jean Larock Jin. How are you today? I'm great. How are you? I'm great. Now, I know that um, a coworker of mine wears a lot of the clothing that you sell on Comfy Clothing, but basically, yeah. what you had to do was reinvent your your old your current business, which is promotions, um, due to the pandemic, and reinvent it as because everything was closed. Can we just talk a little bit about that and how you reinvented yourself? Yeah. So, um, so my business is two promotions, and it's still up and running and, and doing better now that events and stuff are starting to possibly ha be happening again. Um, but last year, when this hit, it hit in my busiest. What's typically my busiest month is the month of March because people are getting ready for golf tournaments and uh, there's uh, conferences being planned and whatnot. So everybody wants to order swag and. Yes. Custom clothing and branded products. So that's that's that was all going to start happening for me. Mm -hmm. And then COVID came along and I thought, oh, my goodness. <laughs> so uh, what did I do? I started baking cinnamon buns and bread and I got fat. And I thought, <laughs> not really, but kind of. <laughs> and so uh, so clothes were starting to get a little snug. And my phone wasn't ringing for Sue Promo. So I thought, what the heck? Um, and anyway, I ended up... Um, just talking to friends and then from my own experience to um, understanding that like there was nowhere to shop yeah. and, and I thought what can I do so I started wearing leggings and <laughs> they're all stretchy and comfortable and people are working from home as I have been all along but I mean still I like to look semi-professional when you when you get out in the public right so um, anyway I, I couldn't find tops long enough to uh, wear with all these leggings that I was buying and so I started researching and I brought in my own line. So I brought in long, comfortable, loose fitting tops um, to accommodate my body and leggings as well. And um, sundresses, you know, now that summer's hitting, but um, yeah, that was sort of how it all started. I started with one big box of, of oversized sweatshirts because I thought that's going to be perfect for the winter. Um, they throw those on with leggings and then my family saw, saw them and some of my girlfriends saw them and they're like, we love them, we love them, we want more. So yeah, yeah, yeah that's how it happened. And then it just, it's, I've just been bringing in more and more and, um, the feedback's been very positive and, um, just, yeah. So that's, that's great. That's now, how it all started. So how did you get the message out that you were going from a promo business to a clothing business? Well, I'm still doing the promo business, so I don't want to, I don't want anybody else. Oh, to right. To your apology. Yes, right. Yeah. Yeah, that's still on the go too. This is just um, I would call it a leg of my of my promo business, um, but yeah. So I just I I talk to my daughters who are more uh, savvy with uh, technical things, and um, they said, "Mom, why don't you put up uh, do a Facebook group?" So that's what I did. That's amazing. And yeah, that I started uh, just plunking images on there and um, getting again getting positive. Re re um, positive feedback so I ordered more in and sold it right away and then more wow. in and sold it right away and so that's my that's next question to you when you when you order in the clothes what's your turnaround time do you find and what's the oh, hottest I, item what's the hottest I, item as soon as I post yeah as soon as I post them like as soon as I get them in I I, I um put the images out there on my Facebook uh, group and then oftentimes I sell out like quickly like within a day so yeah, it's so I knew I was onto something, and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna, okay, I'm going to uh, see how. I'm, I guess I should have called my business uh, my sideline is the Sue uh, Sue Promotions Comfy Cozy COVID Clothing. <laughs> <laughs> I that love been that. A better name. I love that. Well, we yeah. can make that a tagline for you. I think that's a great idea. So, how many people do you have following you right now, and uh, like for your business wise, for the comfy clothes? Um, so I have over thousand now i can't wow, believe it so, that's amazing super yeah super exciting i just put a little contest on my page there if you uh refer your friends to my business then i'm gonna i'm gonna do a draw at the end of the week and give oh. them a um a gift certificate to come shopping so Th that's awesome you gotta and do what you gotta do yeah, yeah for sure well i was just gonna say that to you my hats off to you that you um you thought of such an inventive idea and you didn't crumble with the pandemic. You know what I mean? You, you were positive and you did something positive with it. And that's amazing to have a thousand followers on, on, on your, on your new line. So, um, once your promo business picks back up, cause I know it well, now you're going to be extra busy. You're going to have two businesses to run. Do, yeah. you, do you intend oh, on running yeah. both businesses still? 
Oh yeah, I love it. I love good. I am um, I'm a busy person, so I like to, I like to keep busy and have oh, stuff going on. That's awesome. Okay, so yeah. if I go on Facebook, what am I typing in to make sure I get you? Oh, um, just Google Sue Promotions, comfy, cozy clothing. Good, perfect. Just wanted to say that. I should pop up there. Okay, yeah. great. Well, it was so great to virtually meet you. I do hope we get a chance to have you in here for an interview in person one day and then talk about how you're yeah, clothing everybody in Sault Ste. Marie. That would be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> with, with nice, stretchy, big, comfortable clothing. <laughs> That's awesome. Who doesn't need that? Yeah. Thank you That's very much, great. Lori. It was such a great honor to meet you today. And congratulations and best of luck for more success. Thank you so much. Take care.